Some people in Dorena are asking for more to be done about one of their neighbors and their animals. Videos and photos posted to social media allegedly showed dogs, or excuse me, dogs on the property eating other livestock alive. KEZI 9 News reporter Aaron Ariano spoke with a former neighbor who says this situation has been going on for years. And we need to warn you this story contains disturbing descriptions and images, so please be advised. Animal control and the sheriffs would do nothing. Nothing. Call multiple times every month. And they had the two big dogs killing their goats in across the street and the middle of the street all the time. Michael Levinson is the former next door neighbor to this property in Dorena. Multiple videos and photos on social media appear to show dogs on the properties eating other livestock alive. Levinson says it's been happening for years. They, they had a $2,000 white horse named Zena. Uh, it died on their in their backyard and they left it there for up to a month with their animals eating it. It was horrifying. He says their animals broke through his fencing multiple times, forcing him to spend thousands of dollars on new fencing over the years. It became such a nightmare, Levinson says he was forced to sell the house for a lower amount than what he paid for. This was ongoing. That's why I had to keep lowering the price and lowering price. Took a major loss. I mean, I lost 20 grand on the place selling it and 10 grand on the fencing. Levinson is one of several neighbors who have called the county and their animal control services multiple times over the years reporting animal abuse and neglect. The PIO for the county, Devin Ashbridge, says that they've made contact with the property owner already multiple times. The people sharing these videos with us or calling to tell us about them have good intentions, right? But legally, we can't act on those. We have to have information from people that saw it with their own two eyes. But Levinson says he's testified about the situation before in 2019. He says the consequences for the property owners was not enough. According to the county, the issues on the property only amount to certain code violations, not any criminal conduct. The county says it could pursue harsher charges against the animal owners if more people testified. Right now, an arraignment is set next week for the animal owners to face three counts of animal neglect and one count of evading an animal service officer. Another neighbor who wishes to remain anonymous says fines and a few animal seizures are not enough to fix this problem that's been going on for years. Like they try like on the surface to like fix the problem, but I just feel like it's like too much for them to take. I really feel like because we live out in the country, we're just easier to brush under the rug. What happens if those dogs, you know, kill someone, man? No, nah, it's out of hand. Man. I thank God I'm not on that street right now. I reached out to the occupants on the property seeking comment. They turned me away while accusing all the other neighbors of lying about the situation. Reporting from Dorena, Aaron Ariano, KZI 9 News.